Hey guys, I'm back with another beginner friendly Warframe build video today and I'm gonna be going over Mesa because there was a commenter who wanted to know a Mesa build or a decent Mesa build for newer players because they do struggle with the Mesa. I'm not gonna lie, as a newer player, it's really hard to make Mesa really good in Seal Path. But yeah, here's the build. Pistol Amp for my pistol damage, power drift, intensify, and fortitude for my power strength. Normal intensify is fine, but I think you guys already have umbral intensify if you're already in seal path, so use this. Streamline and equilibrium for energy uh, conversion and efficiency. These are really good together later with my companion. Uh, con constitution and continuity for my power uh, duration or yeah ability duration uh, flow max energy and my survivability mod is only gonna be redirection because she is already pretty tanky with shatter shield as you can see 95% damage reduction so yeah that's the mesa build time to go for my guns so the guns i have furnace strike for damage target cracker and pistol gambit for crit chance and crit damage gunslinger for more fire rate because fire rate is really good Barrel Diffusion for my multi-shot, Lethal Torrent for more fire rate and more multi-shot. Convulsion, my electric mod th that is paired up with Pistol Pestilence to make Corrosive. And it gives me a tiny bit of status because I also want a tiny bit of status so I can proc Corrosive more. And uh, so I can reduce their armor just a tiny bit more. But here is gonna be the highlight of the loadout. Nautilus. This is gonna be very important for your Mesa because that cordon pulls enemy from within 30 meters, which is insane. And for Mesa, shooting into that one specific area is good. I'm gonna be pairing this up with Manifold Bond because Manifold Bond reduces my companion ability cooldown by 3 seconds per enemy that is killed with 3 or more unique status effects. And to pair up my Equilibrium, I'm gonna use Scent Deconstruct, as you can see. Any enemies that are injured in the companion, uh, by the companion will have a 25% chance to drop health or one kill. I'm gonna be pairing Nautilus with Hellstrom. You could also use his normal one, which is Verglass. This thing also has a lot of status, as you can see. Uh, I'm gonna be using Hellstrom though, because it hits people in an area. As you can see, I'm going Viral, Radiation, and Heat. Radiation because I'm against uh, Grenier and Viral, as you can see, does more damage uh, onto health. Prime Firestorm is not needed. You can change this into Terminal Velocity for projectile speed, but I'm going to be using Prime Firestorm for just that tiny bit of range. So yeah, let's get into testing, shall we? So, Mesa. Mesa is really good, but also not the best as a new player. She's really like hard to make good, I guess you can say. Uh, in a way where she doesn't do that much damage against uh, steel path enemies. Uh, oh, there it is, the Nautilus pull. I'll be killing these people. And find a good room if you can. This is how you play Mesa consistently. She just uses Nautilus to help her pull because she needs that pull. As you can see, the more I shoot, the more or the less the circle becomes. And the less the circle becomes, the stronger the damage is. So I would just, I would want to keep my circle in very small and let Nautilus just pull. As you can see, this is how you play Mesa. Uh, very consistently in Seal Path, you do need Nautilus. He is a very important companion for new players. Very important and very, very useful. Who doesn't like when enemies come to you really fast? Oh man, look at that. He's really strong here. 
because I am proccing a lot of status effects. Also, uh, no, I mean that's not because the damage is used from my mods, of course the mods, and also shooting gallery because shooting gallery also get away. Oh my god, whatever. Uh, this is what shooting gallery does: increases damage. And it also jams the weapons of the enemies. So, it's like a mini stun tool. So, it's really useful. Bro! Oh my god, not having rolling guard is a pain. So this is what uh, new players feel like. Oh man. You guys have it rough though. Sheesh. You guys really have it rough. Not having rolling guard. Ugh, man. But as you can see, I'm not really dying because Mesa is really strong. Are they down here? Oh, they are. They are down here. Oh my god. Ugh. Yeah, she's not good against Acolytes, uh, as you will see later. So I'm using my Kuva Brahma to, to kill them really fast. Oh my god, look at that. Oh. Yeah, as you can see, Mesa's subpar. Like, she's doing good damage right now, but it's only because I'm doing a lot of damage because of Viral, and I'm also kind of reducing their armor with Corrosive. Uh, it would be better if you have Nourish on, of course, but new players don't have the helmet system unlocked yet, or if they do, it is still uh, very early, and they probably don't have Grendel yet. To subsume. So this is the best they could probably do. No arcanes, as you guys saw from the video, uh, except for my <laughs> operator arcanes. I will show you what I have there. Of course, it is a very useful arcane for new players. Uh, operator arca arcane, of course. It's a Magnus arcane, so you get it from Onko, uh, which Onko quills in. Uh, Plains of Eidolon or Cetus, Cetus. There you go. That's the word. But yeah. It's better if Mesa finds a room. It's really better if Mesa finds a room like this. Like a small room, they can probably go up. Or, yeah. So she can just keep doing this. Ah, here you go. Demonstration of Mesa against Acolyte. Oh, wait. She's not that bad, actually. What the hell? Maybe I'm tripping. I tested it just now and she's not that strong I guess I guess I was lying there she's pretty strong against Acolyte <laughs> most definitely because of corrosive and viral of course there's no oh wait no they're immune to viral I forgot then most definitely because of corrosive <laughs> my bad guys but yeah as you can see pretty strong against Acolyte I guess I was tripping she wasn't doing that much damage earlier when I was testing her Weird. Oh my god. But yeah, uh, as you can see here too, uh, I'm not using my Medrai Sling because I don't want to make it unfair. Oh wait, I'm not even using Medrai. I'm using Zenerik. Oops. <laughs> ah, man. Mistakes after mistakes today. I just got home, so I'm probably tired. I'm messing up my words a lot more than I usually do. Oh, don't forget to shatter shield because that's useful. Oh. As you can see, it's decent, right? It's not the best because it is a beginner friendly build. Uh, I will do a recap and uh, show you what you can do better if you have the mods. And so yeah, I'll be extracting right now. Uh, beginner friendly builds are really hard to build. I'm not gonna lie. Because you need to be in the same position as the as the new players. So no arcanes. <laughs> no arcanes. Uh, no rolling guard. And probably no Madurai because people use Xenerix. Xenerix like the best beginner uh, focus school because it gives free energy. But yeah, recap time. I'll show you what I have again. So these are the mods. Uh, damage for two pistol, power strength, power strength, power strength, duration, duration, max energy, 
energy conversion and also energy efficiency you would want to change this into rolling guard definitely of course you want the status removal and the immunity this is very useful against anything and everything so yeah but for now redirection is fine for pistols upgrade what you want to change here is have Barrel Diffusion changed into Galvanized Diffusion and change Hornet Strike with Galvanized Shot because as you can see it has status effect already plus it gives damage on kill and it stacks, uh, stacks to 3 times oh, it's 3 times on shot so yeah 40 plus 40 plus 40 and uh, as you can see damage direct damage per status type affecting so if I have a lot of status or a lot of uh, status effects like my Hellstrom, I'll do more damage. Yeah, that's the build for the guns. And yeah, you saw the build for the Nautilus here and Hellstrom here. But yeah, that's the build, guys. Goodbye.